Today we're going to be showing you how to install the Corsair Hydro Series H110i GT cooler on your Intel CPU. Included in the package is the cooler, two SP140L fans, a bracket kit, screw kit, and the Corsair Link cable. We'll be setting up the H110i GT to be used as an exhaust. Start by attaching the two fans to the radiator using the long screws included with the screw kit. Next, align the backplate to your motherboard with the notched side of the backplate wrapping around the two socket screws. Secure the backplate by using the four double-headed screws. These should be finger tightened, do not use a wrench. Note that the backplate will have a little bit of give, this is normal. Now we'll mount the cooler to the case. Using the included shorter screws, affix the H110i GT radiator to the top of your enclosure. It may be easiest to mount two of the middle screws first to hold the radiator in place while you secure the rest of it. To affix the water block to the CPU, first remove the plastic protective cap. Attach the magnetic mounting bracket to the block, then slide it down on the four mounting posts. Use the included thumb screw caps to secure the block to the CPU one corner at a time. Next, remove the protective caps from the fan headers attached to the H110i GT and connect the cooler's fans to those headers. Attach the pump header to the CPU fan header on your motherboard then route the power lead to the back of your motherboard tray. Now connect the Corsair Link cable to the water block. Connect the opposite end of the Corsair Link cable to one of your motherboard's USB 2.0 headers. Finally, behind your motherboard tray, connect the H110i GT's power lead to the power supply. If you follow the directions, your new H110i GT should be ready to go. This is Dustin Sklavos with Corsair. Thank you for watching.